was an impressive first quarter of work by the BYU defense. San Diego State only 23 yards of total offense. Don Copeland back to kick. Aaron Roderick hit to receive. A low line drive, and Roderick calls for the fair catch and slides down just inside his own 25-yard line. Take a look at the first quarter statistics. One first down for San Diego State. A very potent offense that's been able to run the ball effectively last week against the top rushing defense, Utah, in the whack. Well, last week it was Utah that was the challenge to run defense. This week it's BYU only giving up 84 yards a game rushing. And the problem is if you don't have any passing game threat, you can't run on very many people. If all they expect you to do is run the football, it's very difficult against a physical defense like BYU. All right, Kevin Federick, the highly recruited quarterback out of Los Alamitos, California. Well, hand off to Jenkins. He will dance his way up near the 30-yard line. Rushing one receiving tie to school record, averaging 8.1 yards per carry against San Jose State. You know, we talked to him uh, a couple days ago, and he really doesn't feel like he's done much this year. He thinks he started sluggish. He's just now feeling healthy, but he certainly has the ability to explode on you. Jenkins' seventh carry tonight will net him about a yard and a half. Once again, Rico Curtis up to make the stop. I'll tell you what, Rico Curtis will knock your block off now. <laughs> this guy was, is nor normally and naturally a strong safety. They moved him to free safety right before the Arizona game. He's playing a little bit out of position. He is a physical, physical guy that loves to hit. And we've already seen two or three occasions tonight where he has really come up and laid the wood on somebody. Rico, a cousin of Kevin Smith, a defensive back for the Dallas Cowboys. Federick has a receiver in his hooks. And he will have the first down up near the 40-yard line. There's a look at Brian Russell, the Aztec quarterback. And the San Diego State faithful have got to be wondering if they can get this young man back in the football game. He has been the catalyst of their four-game winning streak. Road told you a little bit ago he was having trouble with his vision. He looked to be okay, but trying to get the cobwebs to clear. The high formation for BYU. Again, to the freshman Mahe. Up to about the 47 yard line. There's Scott Johnson starting at weak side linebacker. And one of the big dis disadvantages for San Diego State defensively tonight, Todd, has got to be the loss or the absence of Joey Mayo, their strong middle linebacker. Yeah, he's really been a physical presence for him. A guy that plays with great instincts and has been one of the real leaders on the defense. Second and three, still in their own territory once again. Great pursuit on the left side by San Diego State. Wherever. I don't think that San Diego State is going to be able to be successful stopping this BYU offense tonight unless they continue to bring pressure, unless they continue to bring linebackers or bring the strong safety. The success they have had in stopping BYU tonight has come from pressuring the line of scrimmage and bringing extra people. When they've sat back and played zone, Kevin Federick has really made a bet. Well, third and short. And we'll hand it off once again to Jenkins, and he may not have gotten there. Jerry, thank you. And we are giving out pops. You did say the defense of BYU would be a key. You said the old guys team was going to be leading. It's okay. Well, that's true so far. PCL completely torn prior to the first game of the year. Huge hole right side for Jenkins, still on his feet. And down inside the 20-yard line, second and third effort. They'll give him the first down. Very effective in the red zone, 33 of 35 inside the 20 this year. Second and goal from the nine-yard line. Federick will give it off to the right side and stacked up is Ronnie Jenkins for a loss of about a yard. Well, BYU one of seven on third down conversions. This time Federick throws the pass and he can't quite hang on. Intended punt. Hotchman will attempt a 27-yarder. And this one, no good. Off to the right, so...
Fresno State's got some big bodies up there, and they've pretty much been physical with everybody that they've played. Utah last week was a good running defense. San Diego State ran for 190 yards against them. But this BYU defense, in the front four in particular, has, has maintained control of the line of scrimmage. I mean, San Diego State ran effectively against Arizona. There's a swarm defense. Asus Reyes on the flanker screen, and he is upended on a great tackle by guess who? Rob Marks. The backside, Russell looking downfield, has a receiver, and, well, there may have been some contact there prior to the ball's arrival. You get a good play on first down, you get a second and short. You've not had many second and short situations all night. And now you get the penalty and you push yourself back again. Again, the long setback. Lewis cuts it back inside, has some running room, 15, 10, and is shoved out of bounds inside the 10 yard line. And Russell unloads it in the direction of his tight end, Jim Angie. They have been effective down here going. Damon Gordine. This time will hand it off to Lewis in the backfield, and he is met head on in the middle linebacker spot. Russell getting some heat, and Go State is going for it. Fourth and goal, a nine yard line. Russell, good protection. And he unloads it in the end zone, and intended for Damon Gordine, Ryan Gray there in the coverage. They use two guys. First, Wong works on him, and then the back, who's leading the play, leading the quarterback, Aaron Cup, gets out there and gets a piece of him. So, yeah, I give a call to Eric Lewis from the secondary for San Diego State. Yeah. Great coverage. The booth tonight was nice and cozy, little foot heater. All right, Federick, uh, and he will be chased down about the 35 yard line. Let's see if we can check in if, once again with Holly on the sidelines. Okay. Way to the championship game, so huge stakes tonight. There, a look at the standings, the conference, and overall standings for San Diego State and BYU. But this one is far from over. It's a 13-point football game. And if you know anything about the history of BYU and San Diego State, you don't want to go anywhere. They have had some wild finishes here in the 90s. I wonder how many of those games in the past that San Diego State would have had under 100 yards of total offense with four minutes left in the ball game. State. Now, granted, when they played Wisconsin and USC and Arizona in the opening part of the year, they couldn't convert on third down. They lost all their football games. And once again tonight, they have not been able to convert. Well, if you can't make this one, then you don't deserve to have a chance to win the football game. This is the strength of Arizona State. And I'm also drying off his hands. I wonder if that was a clue he's going to throw the football. Looking downfield, well, Puckett has some running room, 30, 25, down to the 20-yard line, and that'll be enough. Ryan Russell has gained 28 yards in the last two, two plays. Trying to do it on his own. First and goal inside the 10-yard line. Russell looks to the end zone, and Nick. Out on their feet here in 12 hole. Russell looks for the end zone, and from about the 14-yard line, they are in two-down territory, and they will, they just barely get the play off, and Russell looks to the end zone, and Reyes makes the catch, but he is out of bounds. Oh, my. What a difference maker that one would have been. Fourth down. Russell back to pass, and... And now BYU will take over. Well, I'm sure Ted Toner doesn't know how close this call was on third down. He thought there was an interference on fourth down. But let's look at the third down play again. The first look, it looked like his foot was off the ground when he made the catch. It's off. It comes down right there. His foot clearly makes contact with the ground before he goes out. Take a look again. Beautiful throw by Russell right over the corner and the left foot down. And that was definitely a touchdown. Once again, our final score, BYU 13, San Diego State nothing. Remember, coming up next is...